I used to fight my way through the brick wall. You know, I, I kept hitting the wall. I'd have nervous breakdowns. For five years, Nathan Thompson kept a secret from his family, his mates, and even from himself. Didn't know anything about depression, didn't know anything about anxiety, didn't know anything about mental health, to be honest. All I knew was I wanted to be uh, perceived as a strong footballer and a strong bloke. But Nathan's burden grew heavier and heavier till one day after a team meeting, the Hawthorne vice captain spoke heart to heart with his coach, Peter Schwab. Peter Swab said an amazing thing to me in the, uh, in the rooms when I was um, sitting in there and an absolute mess really. He, he said to me, Tom, I, uh, I don't mind, you know, I'll support you with whatever you do. Just want you to think about one thing and that is if you go away and you don't actually sort out your health and what's going on, will this follow you wherever you go? And it was like a, a light bulb moment in my life. And Pete just looked me in the eye and said, mate, this is not about footy, this is about you. I saw depression as a weakness and uh, now I realise it is an illness and see no shame in seeking medical help for the condition. Nathan Thompson's announcement in May 2004 was the first time an AFL footballer publicly revealed mental health issues. For him and his family and friends and, and, his, and his general well-being, it was the best thing he ever did. I, firstly, I, I had to be honest with myself. I had to be honest that I had a serious problem that needed help. I then had to go about finding what sort of help was required to get me back on my feet. He was just really honest with me, honest with his family and most importantly he was honest with himself. We're certainly in a, in a wonderful place now, three beautiful kids and very, very, uh, very happy. From that point in 2004 um, and having that discussion with Swabby, I certainly have learned a lot more about myself. One thing I was able to come out of the other side is really understanding the person that I want to be as a husband and a father, uh, the type of family man that um, how I wanted to live my life. If you or your mate is having a tough time, visit mantherapy.org.au and take action against depression and anxiety.